What's up, Aries? Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, what's up? Come on in here, hop on the couch, kick your feet up, relax, and enjoy yourselves, boo. Grab your weed, blunt, cigarettes, drink, fruit, water. Hell, I don't give a fuck, just do you. But allow me to say thank you to all my beautiful subscribers for all the love and support that you show me. Because you don't have to, boo, and you're doing for that. It truly means the world to me. Thank you so much, my love bucks. All right, Aries, we're back with another love reading on what's currently going on in your love life. So I already pulled out the card, so let's get started. All right, Aries, it's somebody that you ain't been talking to. You know what I'm saying? You ain't been speaking to. You made the choice to not speak to. Okay, you made a sound decision. Okay, you could have made a decide. Could have took a long time to make a decision on releasing this person because you really did love them. Okay, but it probably, you know, it probably took you a while to finally come up with the decision to go solo. Okay, because you just got tired. You was tired of their bullshit. All right, the more you tried, the more they fucked up. Like, God damn. So you got tired because they left a bad taste in your mouth. Okay, this person was hella immature, okay? You trying to do some adult shit and they just keep hitting you with some just childish, just childish games, playing mind games, okay? You can't do nothing on no adult level. It was always some, just some childish shit coming out this person, okay? Always bringing drama. Always want to play the victim. Play the corporate, then play the victim. You know what I'm saying? Doing shit, then hiding their hand. Then playing stupid. Just a whole lot of drama, okay? So some of you, they could have been stealing from you and shit. Was a whole thief and lying about it. And you knowing they motherfucking ass took it. I know your motherfucking ass got it. Ain't no goddamn body else around me. Shit, but you and me, motherfucker. Who did it? Casper, the friendly ghost. But they was also messing with motherfucking people that was messy and dirty, okay? They could have been messy and dirty physically or just messy and dirty messy and dirty metaphorically you know what i'm saying just mentally just a messy and dirty motherfucker but they like motherfuckers like that because they was messy and dirty okay like dealing with people that was loose goose okay loose and all you know what i'm saying will give it up drop them you know what i'm saying open them legs or get or would, would you know slide in the motherfucking drop of a dime they had a, a side piece that was a messy dirty motherfucker too probably a motherfucker that you was beefing with some of y'all was going through, you know what I'm saying? Y'all was beefing with this motherfucker. Mm -hmm. But then, yeah, this motherfucker that you left, you made a sound decision to leave because you really loved him, you know what I'm saying? You tried your tried your best to make it work between you and this motherfucker, but it just didn't work, you know what I'm saying? So you had to go solo. But even who this motherfucker is falling apart, honey. This motherfucker is falling apart, going crazy boots, all right? Crazy without you, you yep. know? Ever since you rejected them and moved on, you know, they never thought you would move on. You probably you probably held it down. Y'all probably been fucking with each other for a long ass time. So they never thought, you know what I'm saying? They thought you was gonna continue to accept they bullshit, okay? Shit, long and behold. Alright, so this person is depressed, okay, going through it. They confused. Alright. Going through the dark night of the soul. Upset. Being a hater. Okay, cause some of y'all moved on to other people, okay, and if y'all haven't met this person, y'all will soon be meeting this person, okay, out of nowhere, it's gonna happen out of, out of the blue, okay, when you at least expect it, all right, for some of you, y'all gonna be, y'all gonna meet this motherfucker at the club, because y'all like the club, hey, y'all like the party, hey, hey. y'all gonna meet this motherfucker at the club and shit, okay, some of y'all, y'all gonna meet the motherfucker at the donut shop, but y'all gonna have a lot of chemistry, okay, you gonna y'all gonna like the same things and shit. You gonna actually have an adult motherfucking conversation, a civilized conversation. Like, god damn. This motherfucker's smart too. Oh my god. Okay. It's gonna turn you on even more because you you got so used to, you know, dealing with an immature, uh, uneducated motherfucker. Now this person is educated and shit. Okay, just knocking your socks off. All right. And you, you guys have a lot of pain. It's gonna be a passionate. Uh, connection, all right, y'all gonna be rolling around all in the motherfucking bed, okay, Ooh, okay, so the sun come up, to the sun go down, to the sun come up, to the sun go down, all right, yeah, because you're gonna realize it's your ride or die, and they gonna know that you, they ride or die, okay, that's what I'm talking about, yeah, this person feels that you're different, okay, you different too, just as much as you feel that they different, they feel that you're different too, I mean, because you is, shit, all right, and this person gonna want to be generous towards you and the connection. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. They gonna be giving you gifts and shit, showering you with gifts and shit. 
Because you fine as wide and you different to them, all right? Mm -hmm. Some of you, they want, they going to start a family with you, okay? They can have their own business or want to start a business with you, okay? Yes, they do, all right? That's what's good. But some of you red could be uh, significant. Here's some more messages. So that's what's up. And they only came around. You only did, you only came uh, was able to deal with this person because you finally made the decision to stop talking to this motherfucker and release this motherfucker right here that left a bad taste in your mouth. You know what I'm saying? But you finally had to get tired. All right. Like I said, you 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 you. Sh you let this motherfucker get away with murder. And you still was there holding it down. But hey, you finally got tired. Okay, it was something that they did that was the last straw. Yeah, Mr. Mr. Right or Mrs. Right can't come along when you keep fucking with Mr. Mr. and Mrs. Wrong. Golly, you gotta close one door in order for one to open, you know? And if the motherfucker ain't adding in your life, damn sure don't let him subtract. I don't give a fuck who you is. Don't ever let a motherfucker do that. It ain't that much, it ain't that much motherfucking love in the world. Because a real motherfucker ain't going to let you fall because they fail. Hell nah. They ain't going to do that. They ain't going to do that. Not if they really love you and care about you, right? They don't want to see you falling. Wait a minute. Now you calling, now you messing with a motherfucker that's adding in your life, okay? That's adding. They not subtracting, they adding. Always messing with a motherfucker that's going to add to your life. A person can only take you two ways, up and down. Up or down, okay? It's up to you whether you decide on how, where you want to go, okay? So, you know, a person only let you do what you allow them to do. If you're going to let a motherfucker take you down, don't do that. Don't do that. We ain't doing that over, not up over here. It's only up over here. We're only going up over here. The sky's the limit. Fuck that down shit. We got to make them prove it. We got control. I'm trying to control the situation to avoid having it control me. <laughs> worried. I'm worried that it may be too late to make things right between us. I helpless. I feel trapped by my circumstances. There's nothing I can do. <clears throat> All right, let's see who this is. Who this could be. We got Leo. Sagittarius. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Uh, what is this? Aries. Scorpio. Pisces. Gemini. Cancer. New Gemini Virgo. All right, let's get you an advice card, and I'll leave it here.
We got kindness. You are a humanitarian made of love and you are able to share that energy with others. All right, me love. So I'm going to leave it here. And if this resonated with you guys, go ahead and give your girl a big thumbs up. If not, go ahead and give your girl a big thumbs down. I really don't give a fuck as long as you take heed to the message. All right, me love. So thanks for watching. Until next time, same bad time, same bad channel. All right, deuces.